Okay, so I'm, the power hasn't been turned on yet. I haven't gotten anything swapped over yet. I'm just actually in here. So I'm doing the infamous empty apartment tour. So this is the front door where I enter into the unit at right here. So I'm at the door and then turning around. That is a closet, like a big storage closet. And I'll probably do this again once I uh, switch the power and stuff over. But if you come this way from the door, which is there, there. Okay, so you come this way. This is a guest bathroom here. Okay, and it looks like granite countertops there. And I do believe there is, yeah, it's a sh the shower tub combo. And I know this quality is awful with no lights on. So if you come out of the bathroom there, straight ahead is a bedroom. So let me just turn this way. So you can see there was the door where I came in at. Bathroom. And then if you go in here, this is a bedroom. Here, not a whole lot to see. And then they have the double closets. All I think, they're ceiling fans in all of the uh, rooms. So you come out of here and you have this little half wall situation here. Over there is the kitchen that you could place bar stools at there. And then this is the um, living room space. And it is really large. I don't know how well you can see that on this freaking camera. Another ceiling fan there. Over here is the dining area, which is also huge. I'm going all the way back to the French doors. That is the dining area. Really, really big. Um, coming from the dining area, here is the kitchen area. It's like a galley-style kitchen. And this is how it looks out over the French doors. That's the patio area back there. There's also a lake back there and some construction stuff. So your living room, I'm standing in where the dining room would be. Um, yeah, these are granite countertops here, standard double sinks. Um, not a lot of cabinets, but then who needs a bunch of cabinets because I don't really be cooking like that. So it comes with the stainless steel appliances, um, all electric. So you get the stove, the microwave, and then the stainless steel fridge, which is there. There's dishwasher here, cabinets down below there as well, and a little bit of counter space there. So this is the kitchen, again, that looks out. There's that bathroom, there's that first bedroom, little pendant lights, track lights, and I'm guessing this is probably a pantry. Yeah. That's the pantry there. Um, so that's, again, that's the layout so far. I'm just panning around. Again, I'm standing right here in the dining room table space area. If I had to guess, you could definitely put a six-seater over there, which I won't be. Okay, so then if you come down this way in the apartment, down this little hallway... This first room here is actually the washer dryer. This is the laundry room. It's dark, but they have shelves up in here. And that's where the washer dryer would go. There. This is just like utility hot water heater inside there. And it does come with the door, so you can close it off if you don't want your dirtiness showing. Let me see if there's anything. Okay, yeah. So this is the laundry room here and then back out that way there's the kitchen living room again okay so turning back around this way i'm coming down the same hallway i'm guessing this is a linen closet here nice size linen closet which i actually didn't even have at the house and then if you turn this way here is the second bedroom here Again, with the double closets, um, outside, another ceiling fan, 
There's the double closets over there. And then the door going out. So if you come back out of this room and turn this way, you're in the master, which is twice the size of my bedroom now at home. So ceiling fans again, there is uh, this room. And the color on the walls is like a really off white eggshell looking color. So um, the bedroom is here and this closet is ridiculously huge. Okay, it is humongous in here. Yeah, the, uh, yeah, <laughs> it's big, it's big. And then over here behind the door is my bathroom. So you enter, you have the sink here again with the granite countertops and a big mirror here. If you come on through, it's a little dark. You have the, the combo shower tub and I like it that it has shelves already built in to the um, tub area. And then over here is the toilet where you do your business. And then another linen closet here in the bathroom. So this bathroom is a really nice size, as you can see. It's really big. And I know this lighting is terrible. I got to... Switch the, I just came off the truck, y'all, and parked the truck and came here. So, <laughs> so coming back out, back into the bed, the master bedroom again, like I said. So that's what this looks like. I'm trying to go really slow, you guys. Okay. So lots of natural light without the power even on. Um, so I'm backing down the hallway. So that's guest bedroom number two. Two, master, linen closet, laundry room, which is a really nice size there. I'm still backing. Here is the um, living room area. I'm not sure how much of this freaking... I'm all the way in the far corner of the dining area. And I'm looking out into the kitchen area. And then if I come over here, over here on this side, then that again is where you would put your table chairs and then even room for maybe three bar stools can go there. Half wall here, that's the bathroom, the big closet over there. And I do believe your girl can fit a sectional. This thing is huge. Okay, I'm standing, let me get over here. I'm standing up against this wall here. This camera, I promise you guys, is not doing this thing any justice. And then down there is the hallway area, like I said, to the other two bedrooms there. Um, and there's the front door. And then there's the other bedroom there. And... This is it. And then outside, um, out here is a storage unit. I can show you. This is the patio area here. That's the patio, my patio. And then that is a storage. You can put stuff inside of there to uh, store. Um which I absolutely love. And so, yeah, that's the empty apartment tour so far. So, let me just swip, switch. Switch you guys around really fast. Okay, you guys, so that is the official, I guess, um, empty apartment. This pocketbook is heavy. The official empty apartment tour. I got to go switch the uh, power on into my name from, you know, since it's, you know, not on or whatever. I literally just parked the truck and shot over here. Um, to give you kind of some specs on the actual size of this apartment, it's actually 1,500 square feet, 
three bedrooms, two baths, as you saw, um, with lots of storage areas in the space. So, 1,500 square feet, two bed, two, three bedrooms, two bathrooms, a humongous dining room area. I like how the kitchen opens up to out here so that I can entertain. Way still more space than a girl like myself need, to be honest with you. <laughs> to be honest with you, this is a lot of space in here for little old me. But I absolutely love the layout of it. And I just cannot wait to decorate. Like, I can't wait. So that is it. Let me go and uh, let me go back to work for a second. Um, well, actually, I got to go do something. And then I got to go back to work real quick because my truck is in the shop. But official, empty apartment tour. I know it was dark because the power is not on. But you will get a step-by-step -step of decorating this place room by room one at a time fret not your girl got you hope you enjoyed it and uh come along for the ride with me i'm excited about my new place this is this is me y'all this is me bachelorette haven okay bachelorette haven and it is going to be a shoe free apartment once um i get everything in here because it's completely carpeted and i don't want nothing tracked in this apartment so that right here is also granite or whatever where you put your little bar stools at love 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 one last look around you guys before i head up out of here so yeah that's my tiny apartment 1500 square feet of space for just your girl three bedrooms two baths large walk-in closet laundry room lots of storage areas I'm in love. See you guys in the next video. Hugs and kisses. Everyone stay blessed. Stay positive. Stay right up. Don't let nobody take your mood. Do something good for yourself. And always do something good for somebody else. And get prepared because it's about to go down.